Hello, 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 everyone. Welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. We are where we left off the last time. We finally see the draw that everybody was talking about. And I'm pretty curious how our conversation will unfold. So let me start by going there and the see what the east she has to say. Abandoned. It's not the order how the quest's supposed to be playing out. There's a, a, a witch doctor here that I'm supposed to talk to. There's the clan boss here that I'm supposed to, I guess, talk to. And I guess this is supposed to be the last part, but... Damn. I was never too good at following the predetermined storylines. Sharp eye. Nas. They also have some dialogue, I can tell. Even though I don't see any direct route to them. Maybe here. Yeah. No, that's quite a long way. Let me talk with the elf, just out of curiosity. Before we do that, I do a save game, just to be sure. Hey, Saza. Mistress! It's me, your loyal servant, Saza. I'm back, and I brought a friend. Yeah. How thoughtful. And where did you find this friend? They was in some rickety druid grove, mostly full of tieflings, but them intruders you're after were hiding out there. I presume you dealt with my prey and massacred the rest. Ah, oh. <laughs> well, the thing about that is they sort of massacred us, <laughs> but this mug helped me to escape. I say we stick a few holes in him, show how grateful we are. You feel a cold hand caress your mind as the drow appraises you. Oh dear. Your prisoner is one of the Absolute's favorites, Saza. <laughs> a true soul. I like this girl. No, a compy. They was in a grove, hanging around with the tieflings. Undercover, no doubt. Carrying out the Absolute's will. Oh, Saza, you have made a grave error. And it will be your last. Oh, 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 My spiders are hungry, little one. Oh, but geez. before they feast, I like this woman. Tell me where that grove is. And I may yet spare your life. It's past the bridge, to the east. Big old gate covered in ivy. Don't hurt me, mistress, please. I will not hurt you. My spiders will have that pleasure. No, oh, I'm, no. Up, I'm sorry. But I didn't know who they was. They didn't tell me nothing. Please give me the little girl. <laughs> she was so funny. <laughs> I told you, I was trying to follow orders best I could. Silence, wretch. And remember, you owe your miserable life to this one. I won't cause any more trouble. I swear it. Through sheer luck, that pathetic worm has brought me the information I need. And it seems that the inhabitants of the grove trust you. We can use that against them. You what? have a part to play in this slaughter. Return to the grove. When my raiding party approaches, throw open the gate and signal me. Who, who gave you authority to give me orders, woman? <laughs> I'm here to slaughter you. <laughs> you would dare. Guards to me. <laughs> Out of my sight. Okay. Save the goblin, Saza. So they betrayed us, but we convinced Mitara to spare her life. Let's hope she will remember what we did for her. You receive 
Assassin's Touch. Uh, okay. I wonder if I help the draw slaughter the village he would join us or not. She has 70. Oh jeez, everybody in the room is... shooting for us. And get yourself some dressing. Ew. Hmm. Magic missile, magic missile, magic missile. That was weak. But I might have something else here that I can throw at her. But obviously I will load this one back and I will do the quest in the normal order. But just out of curiosity I wanna see what happens if I, you know, get a little bit of a whacking? Do I have anything I can throw at her? Resistance, potion of sleep. Okay. Uh, oh. Dang it. I didn't want it to be, you know, meal sleeping. That was so weak. Alright. Yeah. Where the heck is the draw? Oh. Saza is hostile to us also. Oh, here is the draw. Bad, I cannot attack. Would have been too funny. I have a poison stuff. Yay! Is she calling somebody? Shadow heart, darling. Praise. Thank you. And throw some shade on her, I guess. Or who is the most? Actually, you are damaged too. But only for three. Actually, nobody is dead damaged, I guess. I have no action. No. no choice but to keep going. Alright, let's use something a bit more drastic. Oh, well, I still have magic missile. As long as I have magic missile, I will use a magic missile. This time she is almost dying. 18 HP. Alright, let me see what else I have in this bag. Elixir of resistance, 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 HP, resistance, antidote, HP, poison. This would be the fine one, but it needs an action. So I don't have anything useful. 
Not too happy about it because the true lady comes. Oh! That was not too happy. Let me. I know I said that I will use magic missile, but I also have this one. Not enough space. Then you go here. Idiot. And then try pushing her into the fireball. Did it work? I think so. She seems to be on fire. Victory awaits. And you. There isn't anything great about this, isn't it? Do a lacerate on this. Was it too too effective, I must say. But I take it, I guess. Alright, what do you have? Ooh, I guess that you have to. Take care of you! Then uh, this one will hit her. I'm pretty sure she will die. Take you. Let me see if I come here. And I can oh I can no longer shove. Meh. The whole world is coming for us. All right. Ooh. <laughs> I definitely need to load this back. I am not equipped to deal with this. I am really, really not equipped to be deal with this. Can I shove her? Oh, I think she resisted that. Was that good at all? Let's try at least kill her. Torment. Saving throw. And she has 6 HP left. Try shove her. Target can be restrained. Then throw this one. Eh, weak. Alright, I guess then a normal attack will do. <laughs> and this is what I wanted to see. And after that I will probably load back because I will not be able to defeat all these guys. And what would be the point? I was coming here all peaceful like for the last two episodes, I don't wanna mess it up. Cyanid. Cyanid's fire once per short rest when the wielder misses an attack. With this weapon, the target is encased in fairy fire. 
Okay, that sounds good. Draw leather gloves. Spider silk armor. Damn. Okay. This is almost as good as the Getty Eki half plate. And this class has light armor. Cool. Advantage on constitution saving throws. And this one? Boots of striding. Focused stride. When you cast a spell that requires concentration, you gain momentum. While you are concentrating, you cannot be pushed or get knocked prone. Damn, she has some nice stuff. Some quite unique stuff, I guess. Although it just says uncommon, so me. Alright, see you in a second when I'm not dying. <laughs> and then we will go on our merry way. Alright, back we are. There's a gilded chest there. Dying's the only thing they're good at. Scrap wood shield. Alright, so we are not tackling the draw. Spears are sharp. The lads are all riled up and ready. I go up here. I want to see what these two are doing here. Because he a beautiful eyes. What do they need to be looking at any of us for? Is what I'm saying. Let me jump down here. We're on the same side. We're going to set the true soul on fire. Oh, there was a ladder there. Heading to see our new pet. It didn't seem easy. I'll give it that. What? The red. What is your new pet? Wait, is this ready yet? I'm hungry. Cheater. No sneaking off. Seen this mess? Flaming fist thuggo took a chunk out my arm last raid out. <laughs> Fiercest thing about him was the wailing. Till we put an end to it. Ugh. Ain't none can stand against us now. Not with the absolute in our corner. Is the absolute in your corner? Did I talk to you or one of your other guys? Watch your step down by the pens. Wargy's been getting fat on your kind lately. Huh. All right. What's in this one? A dagger. Wonder if the gods are watching me. Can't pick up items. I don't want to pick up, I wonder. Oh. Is that under it? I'm just saying. Oh, skeleton. Again, do you want to become spider food? All right, let's look inside this door. Work pens. Okay. Look at that. A hand to chest. Okay. I can take that. This looks like a barrack of some sort. Wish I got a turn at the bear. Oh, lucky. Okay, this looks easy. Some more. Oh, these are look spidery stuff. Mysterious hole. And I see a leg coming out of it. I want to see where that will take me. And these are... Hard to tell. But this looks like 
full of blood, so I guess the works are there. I know, I know. I wanted to talk with the priest first, but the exploration got the better of me. Alright, let's get in here. This seems to be the easiest. <coughs> Silverware. How's it called? Crude maze. <laughs> All right. This was the easy part. I heard some whining. Jesus Christ. I did not mean that. Oh, healing potion. I have to wait for this dude to not be in the way. Is there? Someone's reported a theft in this area. It seems you're the likely culprit. What will you do? What will I do? Try to talk my way out of it, obviously. Maybe we should continue search as well. Have the thieves already been caught? <laughs> Fifteen. Oh no, I don't feel good about that roll. Never mind. I'm good. That's the right cause of action. You speak with impressive conviction. Whoever the thief is, it clearly isn't you. Yes. Scroll of protection from evil and God. I will take that one as soon as the guy moves out. I can't take it until this dude is here. By the way, it's not a thief, it's a Wandal. Butcher rock. Oh, so many meat. Prison key. Okay. Oh, that's a bear. Or, more precisely, the druid we were looking for. Tail. Fair. Oh, the work has names. So cool. Let's see what we have here. Oh yeah, this way. The mystery. Oh, I can actually make it darker. Put your arm in it, Thread. You want to right. come into a weekly? Let's see if they will see me from You're here. There is nothing in these. Locked. Put your arm in it, Thread. You want to grow into a weekly? Ooh. Target. You're gonna be a hunter, so show it. Eh, uh, weak. Or was it? Ah, cool. I have not expected that. Spider silk cocoon. There was a bone in it. Heavy stone, skull, bones. Yeah, 
Heavy, heavy stones. Nothing good. Acid. It couldn't be useful. Dead elf. Wait for a second, I was able to target the elf. I don't seem to be do able to do that now. Eh, Alright, let's check this. Decaying legs protrude from the hole. A failed escape, it seems. Yeah. Let's investigate. Yeah, that was easy. It seems the tunnel collapsed mid-dig and suffocated him. A crooked heart is embroidered on his left shoe. The body comes loose, revealing a tunnel. Perhaps you can escape where he failed. Do I want to? Hmm. I truly wonder. I guess after I freed the bear, instead of Keep going through all one. that jazz. We can use this as, you know, after he will turn back to a human. Alright, let's talk to the butcher. Let's see what we can do about it. Keep it up, one. Butcher Rock. Here to see the bear. Just follow the noise. Wargs have been going crazy for it. Just hope these scraps will satisfy the bunch when they're in this state. Huh. Huh. I can check that. Oh, there's just a bench. Beast Master. Hands so. off. This one's for the pups. That was not really helping. Can I interest you in sleep? You're being arrested for assault. Judging by the look on this guard's face, you're getting off lightly. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> you aren't fighting, merely demonstrating a new martial technique. Ooh, I don't feel good about that. Oh, luckily, luck was on my side in this particular occasion. The guard appears convinced. There's no need to take this further. Nice. This one is still asleep, but I guess I cannot just take the key. Tempers are rising. It's clear not everything you find is at your disposal. Dang it. Nobody actually saw it because this guy is asleep. Yeah. Anyway. Rock. Keep it 
Can I hide? Yes, nobody actually sees me here. A crime's being investigated in this area. You appear to be the prime suspect. Oh no. It seems you're free to go. For now. Just believe, yes. I saw something shiny in there, so I really, really want to try to steal whatever is in there. What do you reckon tiefling meat tastes like? Bad. Butcher rock. Hmm. Alright, I don't immediately see anything here that I could be using. Always I can take boys. out this torch, perhaps that would help me in the stealth. But the steel doesn't look particularly have to keep pushing. sturdy. Oh look at that, works rattling the saggate. I can probably Always let them lose. These boys. And if I let them lose, the works will do the rest, I you think. Grow into a weakling. Kids. Keep your hands steady, three. <coughs> again! Again! Make it squeal again! Oh my god. Druid. Oh, this was not my intention. Ugh. I'm pretty sure this is not the solution to this puzzle. I might need to load back. Three did one HP of damage. There's no disengaging. is interrupted. This is weak. Not enough movement. Okay, let's see. Impero, Alright, that will not move anywhere. Let's see if we can make them sleep as well. One of them. But damn, that butcher is a very hard man to tackle. Alright, let me On my way. go up here. <laughs> the butcher was 
pushing his body down. Damn. Oh no, this ain't good at all. Pass is interrupted. Weak source. Can you jump up here? And I mean, not enough space. This is bullshit. This will take an action. Even though I could technically sort this. How far can I go? Not far enough. I'm not too happy about it, but... Not even not enough movement. Finally, somebody who can come up here. Hmm. I guess this one because she was really wanted to run for the guards. Here come the works. Just in time. Torment. You don't need to go anywhere. This is poor crap. Wait, did I 
really not heal. Oh, it did. It's just a bit slow. Nice! That was a great swing. How is the bear? Eh, could be better. Although we were never in danger, I guess. Can I try this thunder wave? Let me try that. Ah, that is weak. Let me see if I can come here. I guess damage. Damage is damage. One day I'll catch a break. But not this day. Viscera. One should cherish all of nature's bounty, but goblin guts are quite far down the list. You mm. aided a bear without knowing if it would savage you. <laughs> a true friend of nature. Or perhaps a lunatic. Either way, I owe thanks. I am the druid Halson. I know. Indeed. Well, not the most opportune moment, but given the lengths you went to, I assume there's some urgency. Come on then, what's the problem? Unless you'd rather wait for an audience of goblins. Oh, he has X-ray. <laughs> Oak Father preserve you, child. You're infected, aren't you? The Mind Flayer's spawn. But... Something's different. You're aware of the monster inside you. You don't bow to the Absolute like the true souls do. How is this possible? I am the best. <laughs> hmm. Perhaps, but I wouldn't want to place all my faith in blind luck. You weren't speaking lightly when you said you needed help. Let me tell you what I know. And then he's not telling me anything. Come on, developers, you can't do this to me. <laughs> telling me that, let me tell you everything I want to know. And then not tell me anything. There also seems to be no way to remove the parasites without triggering seromorphosis. Uh -oh. Any attempt risks turning the victim into a mind flayer. I guess that's no good news then. Moonrise Towers. Okay. So this dialogue is fully crept out. I know this is early access, but you know, no, nothing really works in this one. Innocents go in, true souls come out. Given that all of these true souls are infected, it has to be the source for this magic. Okay. I wish I could, but there's still work I've yet to finish. Blood I've yet to spill. Well, look at that. I've no right to ask more of you. But if you could help me, I'd be free to join your journey to Moonrise. I cannot allow these butchers to threaten my grove. The natural order must be protected. Hmm. 
my thanks. If you prevail, I'll owe you the debt of a lifetime. Rare is the beast that survives decapitation. Help me eliminate the Drow Minthara, the Hobgoblin Draw Ragslin, and that perversion of a priestess, Gut. They are the ones holding these parasites together. Remove them, and nature will cure itself. Hmm. There is no safety. Not while this rot festers. Once it is cut out, once the grove is secure, then I shall leave. <laughs> May Sylvanus guide your hand. Focus on the leaders. That's all it will take to restore the balance here. I kind of figured that one out. If you remember one of the previous episodes, I was... Oh, look at that. Linebreaker boots. Adrenaline rush. When the wearer dashes or takes similar action during combat, you gain race for three turns. Okay, okay. Three. Three of them bad on. Okay. To the prison, but there are no more doors. Wooden chest. Now, I actually, can look into this. Uh, Beastmaster's chain, animal friendship, enchantments. Oh, this is great! I would definitely take this. This means I can charm animals. What the heck was this amulet of seven is chosen? Yeah, this is good too. Meh. Alright, you can have this. I pick... I don't need this. Where is the other one? Plop. I wanna talk to any of us. And I guess... Ah, for the moment. You can put that on. That was also a prison key here. So there were more ways to... ...heal. Sever torso. Open up. Ooh, pick. For cloying. Camp supplies. That's good, I could use them. Nothing there. I, I'm not touching these meat. They, that doesn't look too promising of a meat to me. I don't really like how this fight turned out. I really, really wanted to do this without bloodshed. But I guess it is what it is, as they say. Although I know I shouldn't say it is what it is. Things are just is. Or I guess are. Skeletons. Nothing particularly useful. I kind of half expected there to be some sort of a, an extra stuff in here. Roller Birka. Come on. It's not that far. Birka, by the way, means sheep in Hungarian, in case you wouldn't know. Oh, look at that. Cool stuff. Burning hands. Mage armor. Pam pam param param param. 
So technically I could escape now. And I don't think stuff has been alerted. So I think I just... Uh... Oh yeah, we can pick up this scroll now. I'm tempted. Actually, I'm at the 50 minute mark, so let me say my goodbyes for now. And I figure out what I will do next. Maybe I will load back and try to solve this in a less bloody way. I'm pretty sure there's supposed to be a, a non violent way to distract those, release the bear or otherwise convince the people to, you know, not kill the bear. I just have not found it yet. Or I might continue this one since the bear is free, nobody died, I mean, nobody important. So we should be more or less okay. But that and plenty more will be in the next episode, so stay tuned for Magic Jesus and Friends. <laughs> Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. See you in the next adventure, folks. Bye-bye.